This box just arrived. It's my new Mackenzie and Mar baby boat guitar. I ordered it two weeks ago. Came this afternoon FedEx and uh, we're going to have a look at it. I bought it online. I've never seen it because Mackenzie and Mar don't have a distribution network, which is why they say the price, they keep the price down. So uh, I bought it after looking at uh, up on the website, seeing what other people had to say. It all looked good. But I would have liked to see an unboxing just to see what the average guy thinks when he gets one of these. So I'm doing that for any prospective buyers out there. And uh, this is very exciting. This looks like a great guitar online. It looks like all solid wood, rosewood, Adirondack spruce. Uh, great looking guitar. And so we're going to see if what they advertise is real. Uh, I also had helped me to buy this noting that online uh, Mackenzie and Mar seem to have good customer service. I've been told that one of the owners of the company will pick up the phone if you call. And in fact, when I emailed with a couple of stupid questions about this guitar, uh, the owner, Mr. Mar, actually got back to me himself. So I'm pretty confident that the seven day return it policy will be honored if I don't like it. And this video is going to help me decide whether this is Stan or going back to Quebec. So let's get on with it and open the box. Opening up. No, they say uh, a lot of people online say you shouldn't buy these without planning, them. But I was thinking about it afterwards and I realized when I go to a guitar store, I'm so self-conscious and I'm such a crappy guitar player that I've come home without really knowing what I bought anyway. So I don't see the disadvantage right now. Okay, here we go. We got lots of bubble wrap for the kids to play with. Oh, and I see a hard case. I'm going to ask my son and videographer to pull the end of the box away and see what how this is packed. That's wedged in there real nice and solid. Oh yeah, lots of bubble wrap. Lots of bubble wrap. And there's a... That's okay. Now let's just get this turned around. Hey, that's not a bad looking case. That's a real solid case. I'm pleased with that. I'm easy to please. I'm a very poor amateur guitar player, but I'm happy with that. Okay, well, let's have a look inside. So what do we got here? This is very exciting. Always wanted a rosewood guitar. Here we go. Oh yeah, nice guitar, looks nice. Let's see what we got in here. Let's see what we got. Let's look at the case first. Yeah. So there you go, velveteen lined case with a key. We got a key in here. And this is the pick guard. So uh, these guitars ship with a pick guard that you can put on if you want to use the pick guard and um, That's terrific. I, I'm not sure I'm going to use that, but that's a nice little feature I thought after ordering this, you know, it'd be nice if Mackenzie and Mar offered up when you buy them if he uh, they offered you the choice of a uh, You know uh, the brown ones What do they call it? tortoise shell uh, it would make you feel you were customizing your guitar, but it comes with a black one. There's a truss rod, uh, a wrench for the truss rod, and an extra pin for the uh, to hold your strings there, right there, an extra pin. Okay. Okay, that looks good. Now let's put the case on the floor and have a look at this wonderful new instrument here. I'm liking the looks of this, but we got to have a nice, careful go over now. Okay. There we go. Okay. This, I uh, thought I'd sit down here and let you have a better look at this. This uh, guitar is a double O parlor sized guitar, which is what I wanted. If you like a dreadnought, the big sound from a dreadnought, they do make one and with exactly the same specifications, only in the size of a dreadnought. So uh, that's available. Um, uh, this guitar, I am told the following, that it comes with a triple A rated Adirondack Spruce uh, soundboard. And that looks to me like a beautiful piece of 
I can't imagine a finer piece of spruce on there. And uh, the body's all got a nice gloss finish, which I like. And uh, the, it is bound in flame maple, just as I was told. Beautifully, someone's really, uh, really polished this up before they put it in the case. If there's any fingerprints on it, they're mine. It's beautiful. And uh, so flame maple binding around the body and the neck. Um, and uh, uh, and then uh, kind of a mother of pearl around the outside of the body and the rosette is mother of pearl. Uh, what really attracted me was this though. This is a, I'm told, Bolivian book matched rosewood. And that is a very beautiful piece of wood. I'm very, very happy with that. Very happy. Nice, nice finish to it. Uh, then the other thing, uh, we've got a bridge and fretboard made out of, out of uh, ebony. I believe those are ebony pins. And the, in the bridge we have bone here and a bone nut. And they are in fact bone. Beautiful. Uh, the, the fretboard is bound like the body and uh, I am very pleased with the way the frets are finished. They're nicely rolled there and the action, it's all set up beautifully. It looks to me. Uh, Mackenzie and Mar take a day. They, they, these, are, these are made offshore and then they, they have a luthier in uh, Quebec that sets them all up before they put them in the box and it, he's done a good job. So uh, the, uh, the fretboard has markers that are elaborate, they're mother of pearl, and they're kind of a, a little diamonds, very nicely done, with marking on the binding as well as you would expect. Uh, the tuners are Grover open tuners, 18 to one, gold, good quality, uh, very nice, and the headstocks, nice and shiny, well finished, bound like the like the neck. Uh, if there's anything on the guitar that I, I'm not really in love with, I love, the, I love the headstock, I love the logo. I'm not a fan of this Friends since 1958. I, I don't see what that has to do with the guitar, although it, I'm sure it says something about the guys who started the company, that they've been buddies for a long time, but uh, uh, you, could you could leave that off. I, I wouldn't mind that. Uh, other than that, this is a very, very fine instrument. It's got, uh, I'm told, that's a dovetail joint joining the neck to the body. They've put a strap button on the neck and one on the heel with a nice little detail there where the, where the, where the, where the ro uh, rosewood meets. Uh, all in all, I'm totally excited about this. I, ha I know I have seven days to decide if I'm going to keep it, but I can tell you right now, unless there's something really dramatic, uh, hidden effect in here, this is staying with me. This, this is really great. So I'm going to take this now and tune it up and have some fun with it. I'm not going to insult the guitar by playing it for you, but this is just intended to show uh, what the first reaction of the average buyer is to this instrument. And I got to say, for the money you pay for these, this is an, an, is an incredibly nice instrument. And uh, I, I'm, I'm very excited about it. That's a lot of quality for the money you pay for that. I could see you paying if you went to a guitar store and bought, bought a, a, a big brand name. I could see you paying two or three times what uh, what they asked for this guitar. Okay, just the last word about this. I said earlier that I thought the neck was a bit sticky, the finish on it, too glossy. I think yesterday was very humid, and uh, now when I after I've had a chance to sit with this for a while, it's it's nice. It's a matte finish. It's not as 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 a uh, Matt, as as I ex expected, but it's it's acceptable. It's really good. The neck is wide. It's uh, I believe they advertise inch and three quarters. It's a little wider than uh, uh, than I anticipated, but you know what? I like it. Uh, it's uh, really nice, and the the frets uh, are level. There's no buzz anywhere. It's all set up just right. So last word on this. Uh, this is staying with me. This is a much better instrument than I deserve to have and uh, and the sound of it. Yeah, it, it, go online and listen to them uh, it, played by proper guitar players. Like it's a, it's a loud instrument and all the strings play nice and even. They're all nice and loud. It's got a great voice. So that's it. Uh, I'm very happy and this guitar is going to stay with me for a long time.